subscribe. Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Theodore here and today we're gonna be doing something really fun, something really interesting. We, wait, where's my camera? Hold on, be back. Okay, I'm back. This is the camera we're gonna be playing with today. As you guys all know, I have been looking for one of these cameras for the longest time. Well, maybe like the last month, but. Okay guys, different thrift shop, Lego. I'm trying to find a camcorder. Hey right, guys, new day. Same sweater. Yes. I'm gonna go try it. Is that okay? Yeah. yeah. Push here. Okay guys, I'm gonna get it even though there's this condensation operation message. I think I kind of know what's wrong with it. Um, I've been looking, well, I've been wanting this for like over a year now and I finally was like, you know what, I'm just gonna go out and find one. And I did, and I went to a thrift store and the guy was like, $40 and I was like Jesus, you know, if I don't buy this nobody will buy this thing I don't even know if it works or not. It doesn't even come with film. Luckily. I have film at home. It uses VHS C VHS compact. I have it um, at home just a brand new one laying around and you guys will see all that in the video But guys this camera is legit. I really do like it Watch the VHS will come out Let me just push it back in like this and you can re-reuse -re this tape forever, I hope. But I probably would need to buy some, a new one in the future or something or just reuse old tapes. Yay, I finally was able to get one. It's so heavy. It's a VHS recorder, so whatever. And my friends were telling me like, you know, there's some filters now, you replicate that and stuff like that, you know? And I was just like, why? Why would I want to replicate it when I can clearly just find one of these and get the original, the OG stuff, you know? So yeah, I bought one. And yeah, let's just go watch the video. All right, you guys, let's get going. I got a VHSC camera. I hope it works. Thing. That was fast. Yeah, I need to go. Well, it's all yours. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Thanks. Yay! I'm so happy. I got it. You have no idea. I've been dreaming about this. Um, I've been thinking about it for like over a year now and I finally got my hands on one. I mean, it's not hard to come by. It's just lately I've just really want to get one of these. So I'm so happy I actually got one. So yay. We just gotta pray that it works now, so.
I think it's recording. This tripod, I mean this camera is so heavy. It doesn't stand on a normal tripod. I have to put it on my Manfrotto. Oh crap. See? It's so heavy and the little hole is up all the way up here and it's not in the middle so it doesn't even have that much support back here. So yeah, they did a really bad job. But right now I'm gonna do a little makeup tutorial using this guy. Makeup tutorial today. <clears throat> so, first you're gonna use the knit, knit, NYX. I don't even know, just walk. I look ugly. Oh, this is a Billy Blender. I'm Sephora <laughs> and ColourPop. I use this so much for like over a year now and it's barely budging. For the last makeup thing before, I'm using what is this? Um, Etude House. My dear, my slim lips talks. I can't even tell. This thing is so funny. I can't even tell. It looks the same. Of well, I can't really. The lens is right here, but the screen is right here, and I'm just like, hey, I'm right here. No, I can go further this way. That is the end of the makeup tutorial. We are in my filming room. It is a, a really heavy camera to vlog with. Holy crap, this is so heavy, but it's, it's good. See, that is how I'm vlogging right now. This is so ridiculous. See how how big it is. It's huge. I'm wearing black so it's not really helping but can you guys tell? It's huge. It's so heavy compared to my G7X. Yeah. And by the way, it couldn't even stand onto on this tripod because this thing is too weak. This little head is too weak. 
So yeah, I had to put it on my Manfrotto, which is made of better materials. Wait, you can't even see my thumbs up. Really like this Manfrotto tripod. So nice, love it. Um, this one I got from AliExpress. I also love AliExpress. This thing was only four bucks, so yeah, it's whatever. Oh wait, I need to see my. There you go. That is how I'm vlogging right now. Whoa, you can totally see inside. So embarrassing vlogging around with this thing, but gotta do what you gotta do. Carrying this camera is so incredibly heavy. My back hurts now. <laughs> <laughs> Hyper zoom in. Ooh. Oh my god. What are you guys doing? <laughs> this is so fun. Jackie! Jack! Oh my gosh. I want you to literally pee that. Alrighty now guys, we are back here now into my filming room. And how did you guys like this camera? Um, I can't really say anything about this camera. It's not even a review. Not like you guys can go find the exact same one out at Walmart or something. By the way, not sponsored. This is a fun little guy. Um, back then they didn't have like pixels or anything like that because that's digital. Um, back then what they had was lines. Mil like not millions, hundreds of lines that would create this little image and so what you guys see isn't really um, pixels or anything it's just a whole bunch of hundreds of lines mixed together and that's how it creates this one image that you guys see I hope that even made sense 108 digital effects but I don't even know how to use that I'm just thankful that the battery works and everything um, I hope it doesn't die soon, I don't know. But this battery has 1000 milliamps, so it's not bad. Like, it's equivalent to my G7X Mark II. It's so incredibly hard to vlog with this guy, especially carrying it around because it's heavy and it's also really big, so it like doesn't even fit in my bag. So, yeah, um, I don't know how long I can vlog with this for, but for now, it's pretty fun. I mean, definitely my G7 X Mark II is definitely my go-to camera. This was more of like a fun camera to vlog occasionally, like once in a blue moon. But yeah, really fun camera to play with. I'm pretty sure they sell these at like almost every thrift store. If you're lucky, sometimes I wasn't able to find it. But um, if you're lucky, you can probably find it at your local Goodwill or Savers or something like that. But um, yeah, don't give up. Just keep on trying, trying, trying. And I'm sure one day you'll find one of these and they'll be super cheap. I actually didn't buy it for 40 bucks. I bought it for $20. And um, I'm so happy that I bargained with him. I was like, you know what? If I don't buy this, I'm sorry, I have the sniffles. If I don't buy this, nobody will buy this. At first I was like, 10. And we kept haggling and haggling. I, I don't even know why, but I was like, fine, 20. Been here for over a month, so I'll do it for 20. And I was like, okay. I'm gonna spend $20 on something that I don't even know if it works or not and I don't even know if I'm being gypped or not because $20 to me, to me is a lot because I could buy like a lot of stuff for $20 you know on eBay they also sell these guys but um, they're not $20 or $40 so uh, maybe I'm not being gypped but the, even on eBay a lot of them didn't even work just decided to test my luck and buy this guy and turns out 
I was lucky. I hope I'm lucky. I hope this works for a long time because I actually still have a lot of VHC VHSC tapes from back in the day when my parents would record of me when we were little kids. So I need to digitalize all those videos. So I still need this to work for a while. Okay. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. And if you guys did, please do give a thumbs up. Alrighty. Bye guys. Adios. See you later. Bye.